All right, first stop of the day, South Carolina. I'm looking for photo upgrades of <clears throat> lowland shiners. It is 37 freaking degrees. Weather Channel said it'd be about 62 this morning. Uh, the shocking thing is I found a school open. Spot one. I don't think I have any way of presenting properly, though. I need to be able to hold it. The current is really strong. And there's no way for me to hold it in place. Unless there's a spot back there. Unless, the, oh, unless that, that maybe the current is a little dead right there? I don't know. We'll see. What well, is a little dead right there? They're on it. What is it? Is it here? So what, is it first set first? Yes! You gotta be kidding me. There it is. All right. <laughs> yeah, beautiful! I mean, what a, what a freaking trip this has been for uh, targets. And I mean, I, it's, it's so cold right now. And I'm like, oh, worst thing in the world is that, uh, you know, I got to tool around for a bunch of spots. I can go home now. <laughs> First spot. This is what I came for. Uh, I've got a... I'm going to try for some smallmouth and other things uh, when I get to Georgia, but... Wow! I mean, holy crap! That's all I'm here for in South Carolina today. And I find them in the first spot in an impossible place to fish, but they're in the only possible spot. Oh, man. With a tiny little recess of water that's not moving so fast. I got him for a shot. Oh, and this is a tough, as I'm now finding, uh, a really tough. Uh, tough trick to set a hook and pull him over this. Uh, oh man, yeah. You just have to. There's no setting the hook and then seeing if you got him on there. Oh crap. You have to hoist every one of them. Oh, like that one. Oh, no, no, don't want to lose you. For God's sake. Uh, as if to illustrate my point. <laughs> oh, another gorgeous one. Because they're all gorgeous. Oh, that's, uh, I think of all of the effort. Time and effort that went into getting those four taros, Teronotropus species. I guess you weren't coming off. I mean, the trees, come on, really? Yeah. Uh, South Georgia, Alabama, and Florida. To, to, yeah, Florida, the Appalachian came in Florida. And then to just have boom. Uh, first spot, first drop. here. No, they're just in that one tiny little hole there with the, just a slightly less current. Oh man. That's it. You get like a four second window. Bait's hooked up on my sinker. Yeah, they didn't even follow it. If I even have bait on there. Yeah, it's screwed. Ah, just amazing. And I'm having to deal with this stuff. I can barely even... I can barely even drop it. And I tell you, the uh, margin for error with the cast here is ridiculous. Oh, that's a really little one. Oh, that's gorgeous. Okay, I'll stop now. Uh, I don't want to pressure them too much. As a sp oh, that's so beautiful. That's so little. Let's not drop them in these rocks. This is instant death in these rocks. 
Look at this little guy or girl. Check what one it is. That is a beautiful fish. Oh my goodness. Look at these guys. Look at this bruiser, big bruiser right there. Oh man. I think that was number two. I don't know. Woof. Might have been number one. Absolutely amazing fish. That is my fifth Terranotropus species of the year. Four of them, the four prior to these were new species. These are just photo upgrades and man are they ever. One more walk and one more, oh, that's not looking good, huh? I'll find you a nice safe spot to release. Look at that. Here I be, the next spot, the next state. Um, looking uh, ostensibly for smallmouth bass, um, also for anything. I, I don't think I've ever actually fished in mean, the Savannah River drainage. Don't think I've ever fished it. So very few things here wouldn't be new species for me. I think I see shiners flashing in this little incredible looking run right here. Could be wrong. Could be just, I don't know. This whole thing, this, this whole place right here just looks, it's just beyond incredible. Um, just gorgeous. Uh, there's a main, oh, oh yeah, no, I see fish. I don't know what that is. A little bigger than a shiner. Shub or a lapalmus, I don't know. Uh, I think I need to go a little deeper. Get it down in there. Oh, yeah, I see them down there. They're really deep, though. I don't think I'm. Oh, yep, there, there, there's one. What is this? Chub, I, I suspect. I don't know what kind of chub. It might be a new chub for me. Because I don't know what's here. There it is. I'll have to check it out. Well, something seems to been biting on it. Here's the thing. There's, there's like five different little potential ecosystems or, or sets of different kinds of structure right around, right in here. Um, so there's no telling what diversity of species could be here, there, and everywhere. Oop. This another chub. Ah, you take. Lord, I suck at this. Uh, however, I've been places like this before, recently even, where none of them had any fish. But at least it has chubs. Ooh, what are those? Yep, same species as before. Very dark, kind of like a. Chub land. Oh, I just saw one take a whack at it. Oh, oh and then he came back. You could have got him. Well, same thing. Same fish. Son of a bitch. GoPro, you suck. All right, this is the third in a row. Missed two. All right, let's see if my theory is correct. And my theory is... I'll get more bites with bait than with a blank hook. That was a bad throw, though. That's not where they are. Yeah, just slide to the left. You're not sliding to the left. In fact, you're sliding to the right now. Apparently not. Apparently they can just be chubs. All day. Chubs all day. 
Ah, okay. Well. Whoa. All right. I guess I gotta move further down. Maybe I need to go below this drop. Pretty chub stuff. Oh, good old bang bite and then go away. And never come back. That's that's my favorite kind of bite. Anybody can get these bites where like the fish takes the hook in their mouth and you get a chance to hook them. But uh, the ones where they just bang your bait, spit it out. Maybe they're just tugging on the sinker, I don't know. And then never come back. Yeah, that's cool. That's the cool. Oh, there you go. That's a little oh what? Oh man. He was just that was probably a little bass. Just took it and just started kind of strolling with it, and yet he was kind of big. Nope. Well, well that was the same, but a nice looking red breast. All right, a bunch of lapomuses right here. I'm going to drop two. Because some of them might be, what you call it, pumpkin seeds. Wow. Not have it. Now I see it. I see it. You have to actually bite before it goes under the sludge. That was on you guys. That's, that was your fault. And that was on me. That's not where you are. Well, you were. Oh, there you are. I'm sure there's bluegills. But, I don't have a bluegill today, so... Oh. It is, in fact, a spot, it looks like. Yep, spotted. Don't have one of those today, either. Nice. Alright, let's try again. Oh, something just bum-rushed it. But apparently that was all it did. Small little pumpkin seed. It is pumpkin spice season after all. Spicy. Oh, 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 hello. That's a nice little fighter. Of a... Is it? Is it? Is it a little red breast? Yeah, red breast. It is. Spotty enough. I thought it might be a pumpkin.